Russian insurgent leader and imperialist poster boy Igor Gurkin has become an unlikely source of praise for the fighting qualities of the Ukrainian army. Suspected Russian military intelligence officer Gherkin, who led Russian efforts to create breakaway republics in East Ukraine until his removal in August, spoke out in favor of Ukraine's fighting forces during a recent interview with Russia's Tsargrad TV. Я всегда считал, что уничижительные отзывы об украинской армии, об украинцах как о военных, они не только ну, некорректны, они вообще вредны как таковые. Проблема украинской армии в первую очередь в командирах, в руководителях, но не в солдатах. Гиркин rose to notoriety in spring 2014 as the most prominent among a number of Russian nationals leading the anti-Ukrainian insurgency in the Donbass. He gained iconic status among Russian imperialists and was the subject of posters, books and even had toy soldiers produced in his image. Gherkin suffered a considerable loss in prestige after retreating from the insurgent stronghold of Slovyansk, which was liberated by Ukrainian forces in July. In late August, Gherkin was finally removed from the leadership of the Donetsk insurgency. He has since reappeared in Russia and become an outspoken critic of the way in which Russia has managed its East Ukraine insurgency. Moscovite Gherkin claims to be a patriotic freelancer who retired from Russian military intelligence service months before taking up a leadership role in the Kremlin's anti-Ukrainian campaign. He's known to have fought in a number of Russia's post-Soviet conflicts, notably in Moldova, in the immediate aftermath of the Soviet collapse and during the Second Chechen War. He's also suspected of having fought alongside Serbian forces during the 1990s Balkan Wars.